guys welcome back to the channel in today's video I wanted to make a midweek stock market update as well as an update on our stock picks for the week if you have not seen our weekly stock pick video it's appearing right here in the right hand corner take a look at it and if you want to keep up with this on a week to week or day to day basis make sure that you subscribe to the channel guys before I get into it reminding you I'm not a financial advisor this is my own opinion you should do your own research before investing so we're looking at the S&P 500 right here we are approaching all-time highs yet again we are currently not in overvalued status but i'm assuming that we will be once we get past that point and then of course see a slight pullback but hopefully bounce off of that and use it as support so we're going to go over our plays of the week in order so we're going to start off with zion oil and gas ticker symbol znog talked about getting in at about the 28 cent level as you can see, man, this thing just ripped the last couple of days up almost uh, really about 50, about 50 percent or more in the past couple of days. Hit a high of about 50 and a half cents and then kind of slowly starts pulling back. We did kind of get rejected there. So almost an overvalued status. So you, you can expect a sort of a slight pullback. But I'm hoping that we can continue our uptrend and bust through that 51 cent support. And then next up would be that 58 cents resistance level that we need to bust through and hold to confirm an overall reversal trend to the upside. So something coming up for this guys, I got an email, which I'm sure a lot of you did get the email from Zion Oil and Gas about them being featured on a TV show tomorrow night. So we're gonna take a look at that really quick. And I'm gonna talk about how you can find access either during the show or after the show. And then we'll go back and look at our other plays for the week. All right, so first of all, they sent an email out and then almost immediately after they sent a correction email. So make sure that you check your second email. That's going to be the most up-to-date and accurate for you. And it says, June 23rd, 2021, Dear Zion supporters and shareholders, Zion Oil and Gas will be highlighted on Insights Israel and the Middle East broadcast on TBN tomorrow night, which is Thursday, at 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 8.30 Central Time, 7.30 Mountain Time, 6.30 Pacific Time. Is watch a preview now which we're about to do and then if you miss it on tvn you can watch it free online here i'm going to link this in the description below that way if any of you miss it you can go ahead and take a look and then of course i'll make an updated video for you after the show after i watch it kind of breaking down what was said about zion oil and gas let's take a look at that quick video that they have for the preview and then we'll get into our other two plays and break down the charts on those Everywhere you set foot in this land, you're stepping on and through history. We are really proud to be one of the main countries that dominate cyberspace. We are in the place that everything starts. Shalom and welcome to Insights. We're here to connect the dots between the land, the Bible, and current events. So this is ground zero, huh? <laughs> Everything from here is pipe to convey water to Jerusalem. Amazing. God talked to me, man. Exactly where he told us the oil was is there. Our solutions help to prevent hundreds of terror attacks, hundreds. All right, guys, so that is exciting stuff. Can't wait until tomorrow night to check that out. So now we're moving on to FNGU. Uh, I took profits on FNGU. I'm still in Zion Oil and Gas. I'm in that for the longer term, guys. So I'm looking at just averaging down on that later this week using some of the profits I just earned from FNGU. So I talked about potential for a small bounce down off of the support line. We didn't even get that low. We got a buy signal. So we got all the way up here to... Uh, 34 50 or so were overvalued so right there is where I like to take some profits off the table so I did sell that position and now I have some money freed up which I'll be using to buy more Zion oil and gas probably tomorrow or Friday okay uh, next one up was ticker symbol T-E-L-L -L, and this one here um, if you got in roughly about the four dollar mark then it might not be a bad idea to, if you're in and you're, you're up to have profits. Might not be a bad idea to take some off the table because you're not really moving like I thought we might on this. I thought we may try to bump up and try to go around the 450 level, but you don't have a whole lot of volume on it, really not much happening. You can kind of take a look at this buy signal here, see if you're going to get some confirmation off of it. But other than that, 
might not be a bad idea to take some profit off the table if you were doing it for a swing play. Now, last night I made a video talking about a swing play for IDEX, okay? And my entry was 280, I thought it was 280, but it actually filled at 281, all right? And I made that trade late yesterday afternoon and it rose all the way up to $3.08. I cashed out at 306, all right, which made about roughly about a 9% profit. So my estimated profit target was seven to 10%. I took my nine and I ran with it. So anyway, guys, I just wanted to let you know what I did. I want to let you know an update on the market, on the plays that we have for the week. Tune in tomorrow night uh, for an update on Zion Oil and Gas off of that TV show. I'll make a video for it. And other than that, guys, we'll catch you in the next video. All right, guys, that's all I have for you in this video. Make sure that you smash the thumbs up button if you found value in today's video. And if you enjoy our content, of course, subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell. That way YouTube can let you know every time we release new content. Other than that, guys, we'll catch you in the next video.